What's going on there folks? Good evening, uh, Earthmaster once again here on the live stream with an update video here real quick on a 6.1 earthquake coming in here around the Philippines. Looks like on the uh, just the western portion here of the Philippine plate. Let's go ahead and check out the latest activity here on the map. Stand by for just a second here. Just about ready to go to bed, but the this earthquake came in here so we'll go ahead and cover that real quick nothing coming in yet from the usgs um, they are a little late to the party of course like normal this activity is coming in from the emsc model uh, with a 6.1 earthquake in the philippines about eight minutes ago uh, so a pretty new earthquake um, here on the map again this area has seen uh, just a little bit of activity throughout the day today uh, this may be just enough to relieve a little bit of pressure out here along the west coast here. I'm kind of curious to see what the EMSC model is going to put this earthquake at. But uh, again, 6.1 from the EMSC model. It looks like about 10 kilometers deep. Uh, the map, I'll go ahead and check out the interactive map here real quick. And you can see that it's uh, down here towards the south. Of course... Um, up here north of Manila, uh, when was it? A couple weeks ago or so, we had that uh, somewhat larger quake. Let me bring this up here real quick. We'll go the last 30 days or so. That's a lot of activity. That's probably too many. But uh, I'll give you guys a little clue where that uh, other quake was. That was 7.0. Looks like uh, last, well, yeah, towards the end of July time frame is when that earthquake struck. So now we're getting some further... Uh, large scale movement down south here and uh, looks like we've seen a, a trail of deeper movement around the Philippine Trench and uh, maybe one earthquake over here looks like a 5.5 um, last week sometime but uh, yeah things things look like they're starting to ramp back up again in this area finally getting some of that westward p uh, pressure that we've been looking for uh, most of the most of the activity right now has been confined here to the North American plate and up here along Alaska and uh, portions of the Middle America Trench. But it looks like it's starting to unfold today. We've seen a trail of activity up north. Now some further movement here around the Philippines. So once again, 6.1 earthquake uh, coming in to the Philippines. I don't believe that there's going to be any type of tsunami statement, but we always like to check because they do come in uh, with the magnitudes on occasion. Doesn't look like anything being reported here. It is, what, Friday night, early Saturday morning, so uh, maybe the USGS is, uh, you know, late to the party again. But uh, anyway, all right, guys, have a good night. Getting active once again. Uh, I think with this further movement that we've seen here around the Philippines, um, considering that uh, it is around the southwestern portion here of the Philippine Plate. That could ultimately uh, add some further strain up north along this area, the way the plate dynamics work. Um, so keep an eye up north here around the Kurokamachaka Trench where we have been seeing a little activity today, Japan region uh, as well. So, all right guys, if this changes or if it comes up a different magnitude, I will provide it here in the... Um, update video but uh, 6.1 and I want to show you guys we're getting a little signature there in the Japan area uh, let me show you guys here real quick the seismograph picking up that 6.1 uh, not Petrolia but it's going to be this station right here in Japan little signature of that uh, distant earthquake there on the Japan station so looks like it could possibly be a little bit less than a six pointer but we'll see what uh the usgs comes out with but for now 6.1 philippines have a good night everyone peace out